This is question 19. College Board is asking us to convert units from kilometers per hour to meters per second. So I'm going to write 90 kilometers per hour because per means divide by. I'm going to convert it to minutes because one hour is 60 minutes. And I put one hour in the numerator because that will cancel my hours in the denominator here. And now I'll convert to seconds because one minute is the same as 60 seconds. And I like writing my conversion factors as fractions that are equal to one because if one minute equals 60 seconds, I can multiply it by that and I'm not changing anything because I'm multiplying by one. So the minutes cancel and that gives me kilometers per second but I want meters per second and since kilometers is in the numerator I want to cancel it out I'm going to put kilometers in the denominator and 1000 meters is equal to one kilometer so again this fraction is one I can cancel kilometers and I'm left with 90 times 1,000 is 90,000 over 60 times 60 in units of meters per second, which is what College Board is asking for. If you do this on your calculator, make sure that you put the product in parentheses in your denominator or just multiply 60 by 60 first. So 90,000 divided by 60 squared, which is 3,600, gives me exactly 25. Which is choice A. College Board always asks you to do a unit's conversion, and normally the easy way is to write your initial expression, and remember that per means divided by, so any per hour or per whatever, what your per will go in the denominator. So kilometers per hour, hours goes in the denominator. And then multiply by fractions equal to one from your known conversion factors to eventually reach the units they're asking for. Come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.